The UNBC basketball season is just a day away, with the Timberwolves heading to Kamloops for a pair of games against the Thompson Rivers University Wolfpack. The men's program is poised to take that next step and become a playoff team, and head coach Todd Jordan has them ready to go. A big bonus for the T-Wolves this year, newfound depth and skill at the guard position. The UNBC Timberwolves seem poised to take that next step into a playoff team this season, and a lot of that optimism comes from the newfound depth at the guard position. Understanding the position's importance at the CIS level, it was a point of emphasis for coach Todd Jordan this offseason. There's not too many teams out there that don't have a really high-end point guard and, you know, a guy, at least one guy in the perimeter that can score. So, I mean, you gotta, you got to be able to defend that spot. you got to be able to, uh, you know, take care of the basketball there. I mean, it's extremely important. The T-Wolves added a number of backcourt impact players to go along with a strong core. This has turned up the intensity in practice and led to individual development. Everyone that guards me is just, just as good as me, so every practice you got to show up. Having that many guys, you can really go at somebody. Like I can imagine like if you didn't really have a lot of guys at your position, it's just you, you go through the motions. And getting a lot of playing time last year for a first year definitely pushed me this offseason. I mean, it pushed me to stay this summer and train a lot harder to get more minutes because I wanted to be a, a bigger part of this team than I was last year. Jordan figures another benefit will be the ability to play the hot hands each game. The CIS style is grueling and physical, so having fresh legs will be a huge bonus. It means that guys can expend a lot more energy on the floor and not have to worry about, you know, pacing themselves for playing huge amounts of minutes, right? It, it's nice to be able to bring fresh guys in off the bench, and if you have a guy struggling, you know, someone can step in and fill that void on a given night. We can get a lot of guys in, a lot of quick subs, uh, fresh bodies. Like, we got a lot of guys that can go off the dribble, so it's good to have that many guys because you're losing a lot of energy when you're going that much because there are no nights off, even in practice, each player is pushed to find his niche on the UNBC roster. It pushes all of us to you know, play our different roles and play them very well, right? So I'm pushed to shoot the ball and I gotta shoot at a high percentage if I wanna play on the court, right? And it's an expectation we, um, we hold to each other to play our own roles. All the Timberwolves are likely used to being the go-to guy on their past teams, but the staff preaches a team-first attitude, and that will start in the backcourt as the UNBC Timberwolves chase playoff basketball. Certain nights where you might not play as many minutes and have to sacrifice a little bit, there might be other nights where you're called on to do a lot more, so uh, we've really been trying to push that mentality throughout our team, is just that, that whole idea of sacrificing for the team and doing what's best on a given night. 